So bloating is um, abdominal disorder in the gastric tract. So when you have hair or, or gas locked up in the gastrointestinal tract, then you have bloating happening to an individual. You have, an, the, you have the person bloated. So what you can do in that process is to either, you can take a warm bath. If you're bloated, you can take a warm bath. You can um, put lemon in your water. But even before you... Lemon in your drinking water? Yes, lemon in your drinking water. But even if, before you even start on... Bloating could be very, very discomforting. It could um, cause your stomach walls to be tight. So you could have pains in your tummy. Then you could belch severely. And um, you can stop that by taking... You can control your bloating, control bloating by taking mint, things that have mint. You can take a warm bath. You can walk, take a walk. You can take fruits, fruits like um, the citrus fruits. You know, lemon is equal in the family of citrus. You can take citrus fruits, you can take banana, you can take um, kiwi, you can take um, cantaloupe. You know, they're all good fruits for bloating. You can also take, um, I think I, I mentioned you taking mint. You can take anything with mint when you're bloated. Your normal fizzy drink, our everyday fizzy drink, alcohol, you know, causes bloating. Then there's some food that have gas, more gas than the others. So example is beans. So you, you tend to fat when you take beans. You, at times, some lactose is another thing that causes bloating. So you fat, you're very uncomfortable when, when you take some of these fruits, some of this food, then the cruciferous vegetables, example of cruciferous vegetables are lettuce, cabbage, and um, cauliflower. They're all in, in the family. They equally take, they all equally cause bloating. However, these are fruits very good to eat for the body because they are high in fiber. So when you take things that too, that are high in fiber, you need to know how to take them so that you're not constipated. So some, some veggies that causes um, bloating, for example, your normal lettuce can make you bloated, cauliflower, cabbage, you know, can make you bloated. While these vegetables are very good for the body, you need to know how to eat them in small portions. Like they always say, too much of everything is bad. So you take everything in little quantities. They are high in fiber. So you don't just concentrate on food that are very high in fiber and you say you're, you're on a diet. No, that's not how it works. So you take a bit of fiber, you take a bit of um, protein, you take a bit of um, um, carbs, everything together and you, you have a very good diet. When you take too, when you eat too much, eating too much can be, can cause bloating. Drinking too much. Really? You know when you're taking water and you're taking it with straw, yeah. you take, at times you take it in, take it in with gas, with some air. So you can, you can be bloated like that. You can take citrus. You can take um, add a bit of lemon into your water and drink to relieve you. You have your mint leaves. Put the mint leaves in water. Take it as a tea. It's equally good. You have your kiwi. Take some kiwi. Chew on them. It will relieve you. You have um, your grape, your grapefruit, your berries. 
they're equally good. Apple, banana, they are good to combat bloating. 